We turn now tonight to a story about health care, not in Washington, D.C., but in one of the poorest parts of this country where a lot of people simply don't get care. Now this region in the Mississippi Delta is getting help from an idea that started in a place a lot of Americans would consider firmly enemy territory. NBC's Tan Trung has our report. In Baptist Town, Mississippi, there's no shortage of prayer, poverty, or pain. Sister Rosie Washington, Mother Hill. Every Sunday at church, names of the sick are announced. And with each name, Dr. Aaron Shirley shudders. I see lack of access to the care that's needed. Back in the civil rights era, Dr. Shirley fought just to practice medicine here. Now at age 77, he's fighting for a new solution to the health care crisis. And he thinks he's found it in a very old country, Iran. Come hell or high water, <laughs> we'll have a health house up and running. The health house is an idea from Iran, where community health workers, not doctors, deliver screenings and basic medical care. Dr. Shirley and his colleague James Miller traveled more than 7,000 miles to see health houses firsthand. And Iranian doctors came to Mississippi to see if the idea could work in Baptist town. The community health worker doesn't wait for them to come to the health house, they go out amongst the community and knock on the doors. The World Health Organization commends the health house model. It helped cut the infant death rate in Iran by more than 70 percent. Compared to the rest of the country, this state ranks at or near the bottom when it comes to rates of obesity, diabetes, and infant mortality. I would love to see a doctor, you know, to just get a checkup, you know, thoroughly checkup, but, you know, I don't have insurance, so I don't get, I don't get to see one. Sylvester Hoover runs the only business in Baptist Town, and he doesn't care where health solutions come from. Then integrate into... So now, the community is planning. With proper funding, this empty store could be turned into the Mississippi Delta's first health house. Lee Bell is a nurse and is ready to volunteer. We have to go to the people. We have to go to the people that can't come to us. It's an example of how the common enemy of illness can forge unlikely alliances. Tan Trung, NBC News, Baptist Town, Mississippi.